Today we are going to look at e-safety and digital safety lessons for your students with Google. This is another flipped classroom tutorial. Now today we're going to look at something new from Google and it's called Be Internet Awesome. Now this is their e-safety program for students and it includes a fun online game called The Interland where your children get to explore four challenging games and they learn key digital safety lessons. The second half of this is also resources for you as an educator that you can use in class. So let's go ahead and dive in. First of all, go to beinternetawesome.withgoogle.com. I will leave a link to that website in the description below and you can sign up. Now let's go ahead and dive right in by clicking on Explore Interland. Now when I click on that, I am going to be sent to Interland. Now Interland is an online environment developed and designed just for e-safety lessons. Now, as it says, welcome to Interland, a magical place brimming with both awesome and blossom adventures. Now we're going to just quickly go through this and we're going to maximize our screen so that you get to explore and that you get to experience the game as I go through it. And here we are. Now, as you can see, there's four worlds and these four worlds are key concepts. So let's go ahead and start. Let's do this. And we are off on our first adventure. Now this is called the Kind Kingdom and it's all about how to behave online. Digital citizenship at its best. So let's go ahead and play this. Kind Kingdom. So as you can see, everything's explained as you go through it. And it's a simple platforming game, but as you're doing the game itself, as you're playing the game itself, you are learning about these things. And there we go, we're going to send a bit of kindness. Now this allows you to not only play a game with your students in class, but it will also allow them to discuss why have they done certain things, how would they feel if somebody left a negative comment, what sort of comments might they leave to make someone feel better about themselves? And these are all lessons that you can talk about in class. Now the next land is called Reality River. And let's just have a quick look at the four worlds available. So first of all, we have Kind Kingdom, which is all about digital citizenship. Then we have the next one, which is Reality River which is about how you can check your sources and not to fall for fake news. Then we also have Mindful Mountain, which is all about being careful with your sharing permissions and what you share online. And then the final is Tower of Treasure, where you secure your secrets, talk about what's a good password and what makes a safe environment. Now you do not have to complete these in sequence. You can start at whichever island you want or whichever land you want. And once you've completed those, you get a small little token. And that is just a small overview of B Internet Awesome. This is a wonderful program developed by Google to teach internet safety. Now let's just close this and let's have a look at what's available in terms of a curriculum for the teachers. Now when you scroll down, you will see that down below there is a curriculum that you can simply download with a simple click. And you will see that this curriculum outlines the entire program. It is not just about playing games, it's about having these games, it's about connecting with the parents, having the parents understand what you're doing, and it talks about all the different activities within each world. Now, as you can see here, we have Share with Care. Activity one, can you keep a secret? Activity two, the profile guessing game and it goes on and on and on. This gives you an in-depth outlook of what you can expect, what your children will be doing and what they can be doing in class. As you can see it talks about, gives you some discussion points, it gives you goals of the lesson and it even gives you a clear explanation of what the actual activities are. And these activities are both online in the game and offline unplugged activities that you do in class with your students. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, please don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment below. If you've used this Google Be Internet Awesome program, let us know how did you use it? What did you find good about it? What did you find challenging? And what other things would you like to see added? I thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.